Good morning, fans. Unchained Skid with you here again, and we are in Albuquerque. Take a look around. And you can see we are going to go hiking today somewhere up on the east side of Albuquerque. I'll put a map up there for you guys to see where we're going. There's like all these little trails that go in behind the houses. It is awesome. We're going to get started. It's about, oh, 20 to 8 in the morning, so it's nice and cool out but it's supposed to hit like 30 degrees later so we're gonna an early start let's get going what? okay we're still in the shadow over here I'll just give you a little bit of a look around we got cacti here this is uh it's definitely kind of the high desert here as we're uh, heading up uh yeah have a beautiful look at the scenery take a look at the town over there we'll give you some more shots of that in a second here I'm going to pay attention to this slope because it's actually pretty intense. And we'll talk to you again soon. We've emerged into some sunlight. So take a look at that slope. And all of Albuquerque out there. And I don't even think we're not even close to a third of the way up. Having a great time. This is awesome. Good slope. Watch out for the cacti though. All right, let's go. Here, let's give you another view of... Looking forward here. It might get a bit of sun wash, but there's Will and Murph going up ahead. Beautiful, beautiful. A little bit rarefied air here. We're probably above uh, 6,000 now and uh, 6,000 feet and climbing, so lots of fun. We'll see you in a bit. All right, look at this view here. Sorry, I keep pausing and take a look at the view because it's so pretty. Heading up the uh, slopes here and maybe about a quarter of the way up. Uh, very, very uh, steep. Uh, not quite scrambly steep though, so real, real fun. Having a great time still in the shadow and let's uh, keep going. Oh, almost there. You can see that's where the top is there. Well, maybe not through the sun. You can also see, sorry for panning so fast. That's down Albuquerque. I'd say we're about, I don't know, 1,000, 1,500 feet up. This from flying wise, beautiful view, beautiful day, and we'll keep going. Take a look at this guys, that, I don't know if we can see it because it's still close, is eyelash grass because it kind of looks like an eyelash and they have little statues around here of stuff like that showing eyelash grass. Look how up we are, look at that shadow, <sighs> fighting for air. All right, let's go do some more. So here we are, Will tells me that uh, my uh, my eyes aren't so good that uh, we were actually about 500 feet not so long ago, so maybe six-ish now. But uh, you can see that uh, we're getting up there. Albuquerque's good. And that's about where we're going over that way because we're going to do some ridge swapping. But let's take a picture of Murph. Murph, come over here. Oh, there's Murph. Everybody loves a nice dog. All right. Oh, one last thing. Take a look at that shadow on that cactus. Yoink. Yeah. And that's Will giving me the Satan ears. All right, let's get back to it. There's a deer over there. You see him? See him moving? Too bad it's not hunting season. Oh well. I always see them not during hunting season. That's just the way it goes. There's another nice shot for, we're getting there. You can see that that's the ridge line that we're going to there. And some more shots of Albuquerque. I would say I'm sorry to keep showing you the shots, but man, it's nice looking over that, don't you think? Some more shadow stuff. Yeah, it's a beautiful morning. 
Will is making sure over there that Murph has enough water because it's dry and you gotta really, really take care of dogs up here if they, if they get too dehydrated because it's very, very dry. Okay, on we go. 360 shot. We are two thirds, Will says, and we are going about to do the real hard stuff now. Yay. <laughs> That's what we look like. All right, off we go. Trying to hold this level with the horizon so you can get an idea of the slope we're on. Anywhere from 30, sometimes 45 degrees almost. So not quite a scramble, but good fun. Will has pointed out that that's a finger rock. I'm not sure if it's giving us the finger, but there you go. Yet another view of Albuquerque. Now we're way up there. How far up do you think we are now, Will? Oh, I guess it's almost 1700. Oh, really? Oh, wait, the peak's just right up there. Cool. Maybe 1600. So, uh, as you can, I don't know if you see, I'll try and telescope this without losing the camera. Here we are. Very big slope up this last little bit. Not scrambling though, but uh, with uh, a good go. So, which is why we're taking a little break here and getting some oxygen. Okay, let's do the rest of it. Okay, so we've made it to the top of the first part, so I'll have a a little look around here and see again a nice look and we're uh, i think will says we're about 2,000 feet off of of the base and i'll let will explain where we're going to next so where we're going next is we're going to drop down here go over that little ridge there work our way around and then we're going to go down that big ridge down there that you see all the way back to the car that we left at the other trailhead let's have a little murph time Hey Murph, what do you say about all this? Okay, Murph. Yeah, here's your Murph. Here's your Murph. Yeah. What a telegenic dog. Yeah. Okay. All right. We're right, back with you again. Same spot. Uh, we're just going to give you a little 360 here. I'll put this up because uh, it's very, very pretty. Starting over here. That's a nice have a break. All right, let's get to it. Just walking along the shady trail, other side of the mountain. What adventures could be up here? What ogres are so, oh my God! This little view stop before we uh, start heading down that ridge Will was talking about, but that's, uh, you can see it there, North Sandia. You can see the little uh, towers on the top of it there. That's what you can see from Will's house. Down we go. I just gotta tell you that that, that shadow's looking good. Just kidding. Maybe like that? Shoulders? Okay. Narcissist are us. Time to begin. This is a quick example of the going down now. Oh, there's Will way down there. <laughs> Scramble time. All right, as we come to the edge of this ridge, I think this is our best view yet. So yet, yet again, once more Albuquerque. But come on, man, take a look at that. Yeah, pretty cool hike today. All right, let's go down. Trail cam, walking with Will and Murph. A little bit of trail footage. That's a little ways down. We're going this way. Don't trip. Okay. 
it'll be give you an idea of our little descent we're going down there so there's will and the trail and you can almost see where our car is he says where's our car at what's that whereabouts it's not these houses here it's the next valley up okay and the car is somewhere there i'll trust them that's where we're heading so if you take a look that's kind of uh the downward part of this hike getting out all right, I gotta put this away because I need my hands. I had to take another shot going down here, a little bit far ahead of me there. Look at that slope. Went all the way down there. What a great place to hike, eh? All right, I better get my hands free again. Just to take a look, that's where we just came from. And still gotta go down there, but about halfway. -ish. All right, hands free. We stopped for a little break. Murph needed some time. Oh, yeah. Murph needed some time. What do you think, Murph? It's almost time to get going? Maybe. That's where we're going. Almost there. All right, let's go. Getting a little bit hotter now that we're getting uh, down further. Uh, not quite there, but almost. Nice little trail. Almost there. We're way up there at one point. Now we're down here. All right, almost there. So. We're a lot closer. Well, Murph. Well, you can't really see where we came from. It's all the way up there. Yep, we're just taking a little break because, you know, all that energy's got to go somewhere. It's probably into my knee right there. All right, we'll get to the bottom. All right, Will had some public service announcements I'll pass on. First of all, uh, in the evening time, that's the worst time for rattlers, he says. Although, there are snakes around here all the time. I wouldn't do things like look underneath shadows like that. That's where they're probably hiding out. Bring lots of water. You get dehydrated really fast. It's very dry out here. Uh, it's not necessarily the heat that'll get you, but that enormous sun up there. It's actually not that hot out air temperature-wise, but that sun does beat down. So lots and lots of sunscreen for sure. Uh, he says there's scorpions out here, but they won't kill you. They're just going to really make you uncomfortable. So always make sure you shake out your boots if you take them off. Anything I've missed, Will? Have fun. Well, of course. <laughs> All right, we're almost to the bottom. See, way up there to that ridge, that's the ridge that we crossed over. We actually came from uh, the other side, so we're almost there. Okay, see, look, kind of flat now. Oh, so much better. Okay. Okay, I think we're working. Uh, Wilhelm is going to tell you where we actually went there because my explanation at the beginning kind of sucked. So, over to Will. Where did we... Let's see, we got some behind you. Good. Where did we actually go today? Okay, so we hiked in the Sandia Mountains on the east side of Albuquerque, New Mexico. We took Tierra Montanosa all the way east and parked our car. That's the road. And then we just hiked east. Up, up, up until we got to uh, the Whitewash Trail. Follow that up to a ridge up to about 8,000, wandered along that for a bit, and then turned back west and came down the south ridge of Sunset Canyon. And we're just about out of Sunset Canyon and we'll be at Cedar Brook Road. And that's the trailhead. Pretty cool, huh? Well, that's it. We're walking on out. Thanks for coming along on this one. That was a hell of a hike. That was about four hours and I guess about 2,000 feet up and about 1,800 feet down. Yep. So maybe, I don't know, three, four miles at the most. No, not even. Like laterally. Three. Yeah. So lots of fun and good and pure, perfect conditions you can see. I mean, the sun's hot, but boy, the air temperature is just perfect. So I was glad that we got it done early today. So awesome from, uh, from Wilhelm and Murph down the way there and Unchained Skid. We'll get this edited up and put it up. Take care. Bye.